Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Wellness Center Podcast. I'm Jonathan Rivera. I wasn't ready. I'm Gabe Foster. I wasn't fucking ready. Motherfucker, can you understand I wasn't fucking ready? Cut. <laughs> Here. It feels Give me the fucking take. That's weird. Like, let me see. Let me see my swag. Hold up. Let me see my swag. All right, I'm good. Welcome, folks. Part two. <laughs> right. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Wellness Center podcast. I'm Gabe. I'm Jonathan Rivera. And I've got back from a very adventurous trip. So how about how about this? How about you talk about it a little bit? Where, where were you, and why were you there? And why was I so pissed off? Well, you I was were in there. a Mexican drug cartel. Um, smuggling from Mexico to California. No. <laughs> I was in... This wasn't the, you know, the stuff I, I was waiting for. I was in Florida. Living life, man. Wonder Waking why. up to 80 degree weather every fucking day. And I come back to Connecticut in 39 goddamn degrees at night. See, this is stuff I've been dealing with for this whole freaking week. Well, weekend? Yeah, weekend you were out. It sucked. It was so nice. I visited our college. It was raining. Like a motherfucker. I visited our college. It Full was so, yeah. so much fun. So I'm much cold fun right now, man. I'm fucking cold right now. Cause you're you're a bitch. That's why. How does that? Um, never fucking mind. <laughs> never mind, sir. <laughs> oh shit! Do we have questions? Probably don't. <laughs> how do I look like that? Probably don't. I deleted my ass. That's how bad. You did? I, yeah, that's how I know. I never. Where got is it. my ass FM? Can Bruh. you shut up? Where is my ass FM? <laughs> So, oh, never mind. I got the ask FM. Okay. Do we have questions? We do have questions. A question. Well, like two. Another one. Two. One's a question of the day. Do we have two? One's a question of the day. Do we have two? Yes, motherfucker. All right, that's all I want to know. One's a question know. of the day. One's a question from... You're so hostile. I, I didn't understand What anything. the fuck happened when I left? Like, did you get, like, raped or something? you get touched <laughs> appropriately by somebody? Like, <laughs> holy shit. I need a <laughs> Question of the day. Who do you follow on Vine? Damn, man. Why do you got to say that? There's so many people I follow on Vine. It's a fucking question. That's right. That's why I asked it. Uh, I don't know. Oh, my God. King Botch. I got... The fuck you call me? <laughs> I didn't call you shit. Show the fuck I was thing. Call him the fuck down. Oh, yeah. You guys like my new shirt? It's super cute. I <laughs> <laughs> <What> the fuck. <laughs> Can you do that one more time? It looks funny when you... Just look at the mouth. Look at the mouth. <laughs> Oh my god, guys! People are listening to the audio. We're also doing we're also doing a video one too. We're doing video yeah, and audio. Just so uh, people can do the, see the stupid. Is it shit even recording? Is it even recording? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. Just yeah, that would have sure. been tragic. That would have been funny. But uh, do, do I actually have to go to Vine and check who I follow? Yeah, name a few people. God damn it, man! Don't be a bitch. I'm not being a bitch. I'm just saying. Don't be a bitch. It's a lot of work. Don't be a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of them. What but the you know, but I would show some of you something I recently found out for the fucking series, which is hilarious in my opinion. I find it funny. I'll show you later what it is. But the I got fuck are you babbling? Shut about? the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> I got Jesse Campbell, Payne Justin's Aaron Doe. No. Aaron um, Doe, like from Roll Star. Of course, I have Roll Star. World Star. Uh, Robes. Um, Harley Morenstein. Everybody knows who he, I mean, I hope. Who? A good amount of people knows who he, who he is. Who? Harley, Ornstein. Um, Epic Mealtime. Oh, yeah. I didn't recognize him in that picture. Lance 210. Hilarious. I got Nate. <laughs> <laughs> I got Nate. I forgot to tell you that. Oh, my I God. I got you. I got Nate. I got Josh Peck. So Jericho. Ah! I hate that song so much. But That's our just catches. I got 19 notifications. Look at all those followers I just got. And the person that broke my heart. Thanks a lot. Bitch. See, this is, this is... I never fucked. <laughs> Come on, stop! <laughs> <laughs> I never you know fucked. what, just so people can hear it. Ring, I never fucked Drake on my life. Man, fuck's sake, if I did, I manage with him and let him eat my ass like a cup. I never fucked Drake. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> fuck it to you, I have to Holy do this. Shit. I, don't, I don't think it's on my notes. Oh my god. Well, I am following. Why are you so out of the... Why are you so out of the thing? Because I was... Tr- Get in here. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, the fuck? So, I want to do something. People- Wait, I gotta say who I'm following, and we gotta answer the other question, you bitch. Jesus Christ. Well, I am following, um. I am following, um. <laughs> you whore. You fucking whore. This is why he's single. 
This is why he's single. No, this is so cool. I'm single. <laughs> I am following Neil. Um, I'm following Neil. Robot Chicken. I'm uh, following Brandy. At Bran Bran. Bran Bran. Follow her. Um, I am following uh, John. Cole Cabana. Um, uh, cool, cool, cool. A lot of these people are just my friends. <laughs> um, whoever this beer Koskin is, I don't know. He has Very like cost. seven. I don't know who the fuck he is. That's I'm following. True. I eat that. I mean, I'm following Scotty. Whoa, uh, whoa, Scotty whoa, Sire. whoa, 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 Go back. I follow. I eat that. <laughs> don't judge me. Um, I'm following uh, Scotty Sire. You, you know who? That oh is? yeah, I have him. Yeah. It's a fucking dude. <laughs> All I did was shake my head. <laughs> I was debating what to say next. I'm you know sorry, I mean? I'm hostile. Um, I'm following um that. That thing. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that thing too. Um, whoever the fuck that is. Oh, I know. Um, I don't know who this is, but I'm following them. Um, greatest reactions. Um, whoever this Jonathan Rivera is. You know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and unfollow him. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> What the fuck? I wonder, I wonder who's the asshole. I wonder. Holy shit, I know. You can get a notification. <laughs> yeah, just gain a new follower. Let me check. Really? Let me check. Really? Motherfucker. Really? Probably you good. got a notification! Hey! hey! It's me. Look at hey! those followers. Hey, fuck you. <gasps> Sorry, I'm kidding. I got you back. I got you back. <laughs> I got you back. Oh, next question. <laughs> I was about to jump to the stories. Same I'm way. all over the place. It's been a while. I'm still jet lag from a plane that doesn't have jet lag. Um, um, what game system do you play? This is obvious. We talk about all the time. Yeah, sadly. Xbox 360. Yeah, definitely. No, okay. uh, <laughs> we play PlayStation 3 and eventually PS4. Yeah, we usually play that most of the time. I'm more of everywhere. PC. I play fucking Xbox. I go to my friend's house, but that's pretty much it. Oh, N64, of course. I mean, who... Doesn't play I play that, that shit still. Who ne- who doesn't play that shit still? Like sometimes, I don't lie. Sometimes when I'm super, your face is so smooth since you shaved. Motherfucker, you told me one more time. <laughs> he shaved his face. It's like so smooth. <laughs> go ahead, continue the story. <laughs> I'm not gonna continue. Just go on. Basically, he's a nerd. Um, yeah. That's how. It, that's how it goes. we're nerds. I'm happy about it. Though. Yeah, we're nerds. Yeah. So, fuck. There we go. Now it's time. How do you mess that up? Uh, how are you a bitch? I don't know. Motherfucker, <laughs> I'm about to kill you. I'm trying not to curse We you. got it on video and we got it on audio. You just threatened my life. I'm calling the cops. We got we got proof. Um, a woman was charged with killing Hunter's Falcon to save a duck. Okay, so can you repeat that sentence again? I can read. I just want to hear it again. Woman charged okay. with killing Hunter's Falcon to save duck. So, okay, okay, now I can continue. Uh, I, I appreciate that. You want me to write it down and put it in Braille for you too, John? If you have to. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, where the fuck was I? Alright. An Idaho woman faces charges after authorities say she beat a hunter's falcon to death with a beaded scarf after seeing the bird of prey take down a duck. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Just, just imagine that shit. Just because you're dumb. <laughs> Just because imagine- I hate you. No, but just imagine I hate- that. I hate people so much. Imagine that happening right in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> just because I hate you, miss. Your you. name is Patty McDonald, and you're 60 years old, okay? Way to go, Patty. She was charged with a misdemeanor count of beating or harassing an animal <laughs> um, that, that was reported. Authorities say McDonald fractured the skull of the 8-year-old falcon <laughs> named Hornet on January 7th. The duck also wow. died and was being stored as evidence Idaho Fish and Game said. <laughs> what? I have no... That's evidence idea. Idaho Fish I've and Game I've never said. heard of that company before. I feel like they're not legit. <laughs> I don't think um, they're legit. Dinger said... <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, Dinger is the Dinger. Hornet's... Is, is Hornet's owner, who's the Falcon. Dinger. Who was abused. So Dinger. His, Yes, Dinger. <laughs> Dinger is Hornet's owner, who okay. was the victim in this situation from this sixty-year-old woman. He killed a duck. Um, said McDonald should be charged with killing a protected species. He said he was That's about five hundred yards actually. away, about five hundred, not five hundred and one, not five hundred and two, not four hundred ninety-nine yards. He was about an exact five hundred yards away. 
Exactly 500. When Hornet made a successful attack and landed <laughs> with the duck. <laughs> <laughs> a successful attack. So, I mean, they planned it. So, they planned it on Brock. He said he was approaching <laughs> the spot. Then he saw a red Jeep Wrangler. Jeep. Jeep. Pull up to the side of the road and Hornet flew away but appeared injured. So, this bitch hit him with the door, the Jeep. Yeah, and her scarf. Wait, wait. How? So, so it... So, in other words, the fucking Falcon decided it's just like, oh, let's just go through here. And then she just opens the door and it's just like, he just runs into it. No, the Falcon flies into was it. fucking up that duck and she drove over with the door, with the car and opened it and then started hitting him with her scarf. So, like, imagine, like, my dad's Jeep driving up, he opens the door yeah, and like, yeah. oh, shit, let me get my beaded scarf <laughs> just and beat, the shit out of it. beat this Falcon. Sounds like a fun night. Um, blah, Why? blah, blah. blah. This was completely uh, unnecessary in your part, lady. She said she felt bad about injuring someone's pet. And what? she had been very upset about the duck being injured. <laughs> you freaking hypocrite. You're such an um, hypocrite. The blah, 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 blah. blah. She said, uh, or he said, that uh, and determined that the misdemeanor charge was appropriate. Beating or harassing an animal is punishable up to six months in jail and a fine up to five thousand dollars for a first-time offender. No phone listing could be listed for McDonald to try to reach her to comment on Monday. Uh, Dinger said it was a tough to accept what happened because his bird was eight years old. Poor little thing. Poor thing. And falcons can live up to thirty years. You no, know it's funny we don't give a uh, shit when they're with humans. Duck. Yeah, duck's dead. I mean, it happens a lot. What the fuck? Look at fucking duck hunt. It's <laughs> so. a fun game. It's a really fun yeah. game if you guys haven't played it. True. Why's my hair look fucked up? Dude, that's what I'm saying. Mine looks fucked up too. I don't know. Look in this mirror over here real quick. Oh, I'm thinking. Uh, Never mind. They are so gorgeous. They'll set you free. Okay. Okay. I sat on my phone. That was really wrong in the, <laughs> in the camera. Shut up. No. Um, this is something I, I just found it randomly. But this is six embarrassing things that kids... Will never stop doing it. Like, when you were a kid, you never... Up to this point, you still do it for some odd reason. Number one, turning the volume down when watching sex scenes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. 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 I can be like three years old and still do that. Yeah. Because it's weird. It's like, oh. Yeah, you're like, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Whoa Calm there, down, Jersey girl. Shore. Yeah. Whoa there, Jersey Calm Shore. Down. Number two, singing the alphabet song in your head to figure out alphabetical order. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yep. like A, B, C, yep. D. Okay, Q Again, comes can... before A. All right, thanks. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Three, writing the card at the grocery store. Let's be honest. Yeah. Who doesn't do you that? You jump on it, you go... You like, have to. I, yeah, you have like, to try it. How can you not... How can you just stop doing that? Yeah. Four, I don't I don't know about this one, though, but... It's probably white people stuff, but I don't know about it. Always being afraid to say older people's first names. Like, what do you mean? Just older people? Name. Yeah, like say... Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Like, oh, they said other people. No. Like, yeah. Like it is people. weird saying old people's real names. First names. See, I'm fine with it. It, it just is... feels weird because, like, they're old. Yeah, true. I feel like you have to, like, be nice to them. That's yeah, true, true. They're like, hey, my name's Dave. Like, no, bitch. Your name is yeah. Mr. Jenkins. Like, <laughs> Mr. Jenkins. Like, whatever your first name is, I'm not Number listening. five. Jumping all over free food with reckless abandon. Doing What? Let's just say when there's free food, you just go at it. Oh yeah, because it's yeah. free. Yeah. And Who six, doesn't do yeah, that? and six getting tummy aches. Well, you can't stop that. It's your body. Exactly. This is stupid what the stuff. Fuck? Like, like no, no, you are not gonna have a tummy ache. You're not gonna have a tummy ache. Okay, Gary, I fear you. <laughs> so weird. Oh man, I'm talking to my shirt. Everybody who's listening to the audio. Um, Why? Wow, that was weird. Um, you are weird. Okay. But it's okay. This one involves a baby. Oh, a Michigan couple yeah. gets quite a surprise when they meet their new baby. Okay. A Michigan couple told they were having they were having a child. Okay. And they were so excited to have their baby girl. But okay. when it came out, it had a dick. Um, oh. Yeah. Well, so, um... That's yeah. definitely a surprise. Mm-hmm, yeah. Okay. Uh, I had been up for 24 hours, the, how, how the wife said. And I thought my eyes were playing tricks on me. The proud, but oh wait, the father said that. Oh, the father said that. Dick. What do you not know what it looks like? Why are you so shocked about what no, it looks but like? Still, it's, it's, <laughs> no, why I'm is not talking dick? about that. I'm saying no, no, saying no, saying like why is the dad like so shocked about that? Oh why yeah, like, I thought you were talking about me. I was like, dude, I have one. I thought the dad about? was like, what? What is that? 
What, what, want to check again? Like, I don't, I don't uh, think that's right, bro. I don't his think wife right. had a sonogram back in October 2014. 20 uh, weeks into her pregnancy, her husband uh, told ABC News, the technician informed them that they would be adding a second daughter to their family, and they were thrilled. 20 weeks later, on March 2nd, 2015, he had a penis. Um, that's basically what that all says. Yeah, that when the doctor poked his head up and finally announced it was a boy, she thought it was a joke. <laughs> Can you imagine that? Her looks like this. He's like, listen, I got the funniest thing. <laughs> you this hear this is a funny story. Her? This is a funny story. Your daughter has balls. Um, I don't know how else to put this, but, uh, yeah, you're, yeah. You have a boy. <laughs> yeah. In 35 years as a practicing, what the fuck is that? OBGYN? I feel like everybody's gonna be feeling, calling me stupid because I don't know. No, what it's okay. Like. I don't know where it is neither. So she has never seen a mistake like this with one of her patients. How the fuck do you not see that? How do you, do you mix that? that up? You should be fired if you don't know that. That's your job. While such an error is unusual, it's not an error. It's them being stupid. I hate people so much, dude. I hate them so much. Where was this again? Um, it was in Michigan. I'm not going to say anything. I'm done. That's it. That's Once the Williams recovered from their shock, they decided to have some fun with it. What? What? They asked the grandmother to change the child's diaper when they captured her reaction on video. Oh, my God. They asked the fa- they asked the grandparents to change their daughter's diaper. And the mom was like, the grandma was like, Oh, no. Is it that? Look what it grew. <laughs> <laughs> the video no, pretty much says like- it all. Girl, I don't think this is your baby. I don't think something's <laughs> wrong up in here. Like, I don't know what's They're going white. On. They don't talk like that. <laughs> Excuse me, honey. I don't think this is your baby. I think oh something's wrong. The oh, truth is a boy. I, what? I'm expecting in like a week for them to be like, listen, we gave you the wrong kid. The family's not probably foundation for what? No, but didn't it happen when they pulled him out? What? Didn't it happen when they pulled him out? The dad didn't pull out. No, motherfucker. I'm talking about <laughs> pulling out the baby. <laughs> <laughs> he definitely didn't pull up. What are you saying? What are you saying? He tried to pull up. His pull up game is so bad. The way you said it is like, atrocious. The way you're saying they're with the baby, like they pull them out. I mean, you feel like they're gonna just like yank them out. <laughs> no. You know, like when you're like your foot stuck with something, you're like, oh, like that. Like they don't yank the baby out, and they just like it. throw it across the room into a basket. Like, <laughs> sure, me here. <laughs> oh my god, that would hurt. <laughs> no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> oh shit. No, this just no. looked interesting, but I don't know. No. What it is. Five subtle ways to really piss someone off. And this goes on to you because you pissed me off like so fucking much. And same mm. thing with my other friend. Um, number one, you call a person friends? on the phone. Wait, what other friend? You don't have friends? Get the fuck out right now. No, 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 no. <laughs> That's what I thought. Drive See, this is the type of shit I'm talking around, about. Drive me around again, bitch. <laughs> That's right, get the keys. <laughs> Welcome to Corner Time with Gabe and John. <laughs> John has died again. There's no more John. <laughs> John. There's a cactus right down here. I can just whoa, whoa, wait, what? There's a cactus right down here. Back the fuck up with the cactus. <laughs> oh shit. All right then. So fuck what up. you said? There's a cactus right down here. <laughs> Let me just pull it out and poke you with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, sit down. Sit down and tell your story. Story time. Get my bottle. Oh fuck you! <laughs> I'm drinking my bottle, motherfucker. Can you like suck on that thing? <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> Are you fucking done? Oh shit, it's because I haven't seen you in like a week. This is gonna a while. suck. This episode's gonna be so fucking horrible. Five so- Like your vlogging? My- oh! It's still a virgin, so it doesn't count, motherfucker. <laughs> Bars. <laughs> Continue. See, now I'm. What the video and audio are both not recording? No, I know that's just recording. How do you know? I, I see a red light. I see the little red thing over that's there. That's not a light, that's a dot. I see a red dot over there. <laughs> and over here, this is so easy. <laughs> ah! Just check. I didn't delete my history. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Major porn. Um, <laughs> 22 <five> minutes. <laughs> Five so Why the fuck should I know that? Are five you gonna tell the story? Can, can, can you fucking let me? <laughs> fuck. Five so ways to really piss someone off. <laughs> Number one, call for Gabe. Do do a podcast with Jonathan. <laughs> Interrupt him a lot. <laughs> call him a bitch. <laughs> fuck his bitch. Oh! <laughs> He's crying. <laughs> I 
was going to say something, but I'm not going to say it. Is it my eyes? <laughs> <laughs> tell me these things. If I tell you what I'm thinking right now, you'll probably stop that and stop that. <laughs> that was yours, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, <laughs> for, <laughs> Call the person on the phone. Like, when it comes up to, like, stupid shit, like, oh, yeah, I'm over here. It's just like, I don't know, you know, it's just like, you want to come over? No. Oh, no. like, what's his face does? Yeah. Number two, email a link to a funny video now. Okay. You do that to me. You did that to me yesterday. No, but I don't email it to you. At least I send it by text. Let me see. You have to send me a link. I forgot to watch it. I'm not going to watch it now. Number three, the kind of shit that makes me punch you in the face. <laughs> no, I love this. Not three. <laughs> Number three, ask how are you before noon. Why the fuck? <laughs> Is that number one on the list? <laughs> you hang up on me? <laughs> I hung up on him. <laughs> Number three, ask how you are you before noon. Has this happened to you though? How are you? How are you before noon? No, no I'm fine. <laughs> I hate that. Teachers do that shit to me. How are you? Is like happy Miss Monday. Is, I'm like it's, what? It's eight a.m. I don't think I'm pretty fucking happy right now. <laughs> Number four, make a healthy choice. Now, this comes. Th- th- this has to do with people like. Oh my god, I'm gonna start eating salads. I'll be so healthy, and then like a week later, I start eating fucking hamburgers. I did that in Florida. I was like, yo, I'm about to, I'm about to like start eating protein and like lifting weights, and I had like <laughs> pizza that night and like shitload of soda, and I was like, I'm just kidding. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> Number five, get sick. Now, by this, it means being a complete asshole to people when you're. Well, some people get. Completely fucking aggy when they're sick. <laughs> Same thing, girls with a period. But like you. Okay. <laughs> oh man. But most of the time, it's just like, let's say, I'm sick and I just sneeze on y'all the damn fucking time for no reason. You're not sick. I know damn well you're not sick. <laughs> man, I know you have AIDS. AIDS but <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I know you have AIDS, but. <laughs> That was scary, like, in, like... You were sync. about to say it, too. That's the That was in sync scary. You were about to say it. Holy shit. Go away. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm you want to go, sir, or I go? Oh, you done? No. I, I, yeah, I'm already done. Not a funny, really funny one. A close Philadelphia train stop, commonly referred to as Ghost Station, could be re- reopened no. uh, at a cost exceeding $18 million. No, leave it. It's a gold station for a reason. 18 Leave million to reopen this shit. The Delaware River Port Authority is due Leave to receive way. on Wednesday a report. Okay, then let's end the next story. Next one. <laughs> <laughs> Police suspect spray paints face to avoid identification. He spray painted himself black. <laughs> With the black spray paint. That's not racist. A man suspected of stealing a car spray painted his face black in an attempt to evade police in Central California. So, wait. The cops are chasing you in a car. He's you're gonna spray paint it. yourself. He's no, wait, get this. Wait, get this. They know you're in the car and you spray paint yourself black. What do you think? They're just gonna be like, alright, never mind. He's black. Now it's not him. What is this? Grand Theft Auto? Like, what the fuck? can't even do that aggressive bio. <laughs> the Fresno Bee reports Monday that 23-year-old Jose Espinoza, I'm saying your name because you're stupid, you're ran stupid. for police after being caught from, uh, with a stolen car. Officers caught Espinoza <gasps> and arrested him Saturday night with his face painted black. This is the best fucking article you see, I've seen ever. <laughs> oh, my God. He was in there until Monday morning, was immediately known uh, if he has an attor- uh, attorney or not. The pictures are hilarious. Cause there, he didn't even spray no, no. paint. He did not spray paint this part. He spray paint he spray everything like around. here and here, and then like he could have done that and this instead. Just like put like sting. And I can like, understand. This spot here was like all this. This spot here was like all white still. It was like that tan color. It's like bro, I'm I'm still and he spray painted his neck down like here, and then like, that was, <laughs> the rest like, is just like not even his tan. hands, not even his hands, and his tattoo says Espinosa on his back. It says his name on his really? back. Really? It says your really? name. Really? You, you are stupid. <laughs> Are you that stupid? stupid? Oh my god. Now. Oh my god. Switching to stupid. Well. Uh, yeah. N- never mind. I'm not switching to stupid shit because this is actually still stupid. Alternatives <laughs> to Nickelback. Let's be honest. Who likes Nickelback? Do not raise your hand because I know damn well you don't. I like some songs from Nickelback. It's like one of them. That's it. Burn it to the ground. Um. Revolution. Um. Oh god. 
No. I said punch you in the nose. That's a great fucking song. Here's some things. You're a hater. That. I'm listening to Blink 182. I don't like it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't like it anymore. I got annoying as hell. Look at the fat dog. <laughs> now. Back in this um, newspaper. Oh shit, it's on a diet. <laughs> <laughs> Back in this newspaper over there in Idaho, they're like Nickelback, June 13, Idaho Center. You can spend 45 bucks to see Nickelback this week, or you could buy 45 hammers from the dollar store, hang them from the ceiling at eye level, and spend an evening banging the demons out of your dome. Or that $45 would also buy you a lot of pickles, <laughs> which, <laughs> which have more fans on Facebook than the band. It also buy you an introduction to rock guitar. Motherfucker, you fucking... <laughs> pause. Pa- pause. 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 They act- it's guitar... Oh my god, they put... Rock guitar video game. It's guitar hero. Wait, what they put? Rock guitar video. Anyways. Wait a minute. I'm play. Gonna... They weren't also I'm allowed you to see this thing is real. What is it? Rock guitar video game? Rock guitar video. And that's... But let me continue. Would allow you to surpass the band's skill level in five hours or less. Also, five hours could also be enough to see Men in Black 3 five times, buy you a dozen Big Macs, do ten loads of laundry, or so many other experiences as... Dude, what the hell does that say there? What? Right there. Experiences as... Banal? Banal? <laughs> Banal? Banal. And meaningless oh, as shit. seeing Nickelback. But that, but that come without having to actually hear Nickelback. Banal means so lacking in originality as to be obvious oh, and boring. Oh man, banal. It's not like anything you. I was just saying is that banal say banal. <laughs> like yo, you so banal. There's a banal, bro. Like <laughs> what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna see how it sounds. See for saying right. Banal. Probably like banal or something. Banal. Banal. How to pronounce banal? Banal. Banal. Let's see how banal sounds. Banal. How to say Nguyen? Banal, American. Oh, banal. we were way off. <laughs> banal. We were way off. Banal. Banal. We were way banal. off. It's banal, not Holy banal. Holy crap, banal. we were way off. How pro- how would pronounce os? I don't know how to pronounce this. I'll put it. Aswaj. 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 Aswage. Yeah, we are, we are so <laughs> off with these. We are so off with these. Watch, is there? Watch one another one come up. Watch. We are so off. Scene, scene. 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 Yeah, we got one. Right. What the fuck? Scene. Tzatziki. 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 Watch. Greek chachiki. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck was that? Greek chachiki. <laughs> Greek chachiki. Where is it? Greek chachiki. This is not fuck. I thought it was Japanese. Greek chachiki. Where is Greek chachiki? Come with T Z A T Z I K I. It's called T Z A T Z I K I. Where you see Greek zatiki? I can see zatiki, but where you see Greek? Where you see Greek? I see. I see zat or to zat. Zat. Greek Shut the fuck up. That's right, wrong. Next. You are wrong. Damn, you got more than me today. Damn. A tie warned oh, against taking under boob selfies. Damn. This is a crime. Damn it. This is stupid. Thailand's military government warned women on Monday against posting selfie photos of the lower half of their breastuses. A social media trend that has gone viral, really. Whoa. Saying their actions could violate the country's computer crime laws. Wait, Thailand- ha- since when? When the fuck did this happen? I will tell you. Thailand's 2007 Computer Crimes Act bans any material that causes damage to the country's security or causes public panic. How or any obscene panic? computer data which is accessible to the public. Oh, I can't understand the obscene part, but not the other Show us the titties. Right? The culture ministry said if they're, if they're hot enough. said offenders faced up to five years in jail, oh, that's but did not say how they would identify the culprits. <laughs> so that means they literally go through and they're like, oh, side boob. And then uh, <laughs> when people take these under boob selfies, no one can see their faces. Ministry spokesman Amanda. Right, that, that, so that means they're calling people in like, show me your under boob. You guys. So it's like we don't so know. Stu- 
This just sounds so actually, white. That's more, though. This sounds so white. No, wait, that's more, though. Dude, this sounds so white. So it's like, we don't know who they belong to. It's like, encourages others to do the same. That sounded so it's, white. It's sounded from like, like it's from Thailand. We can only warn people to take it to... What the fuck? We take can only up. warn people to not take it up. They are inappropriate actions. No, they're not. The ministry has long criticized for being <laughs> overzealous in its separate censorship of films, music, television, and some Western cultural practices in an attempt to preserve traditional values of a country that is infamous in its raunchy nightlife. A lot of big words in that last paragraph, and I pulled through. So that means our podcast is not allowed in fucking Thailand. Yes. There is a censorship on the world uncensored the in Thailand. Daily- well, how can I say that? Never mind. What childhood games really taught you? What? Yeah. What childhood games really taught you? Remember that game, Doug Doug Goose? Lesson. Bob the different one on the head. Failure to conform in life won't go unpunished. <laughs> No, the recording stopped. Why the, the video hell did it stop? The video stopped recording. So that's when you kept hitting me. I was like, yo, I thought you were talking about Duck Duck Goose. No, I thought I kept hitting you. Because <laughs> the video what stopped the recording. Fuck? But we still have the audio going. What the fuck's happening? What's going on? <laughs> Only. See, now it kept. This is the first time it happens. That was weird. That was weird. That was super um, weird. <laughs> continue. Start over. <laughs> Duck Duck Goose. Lesson. About to. Ah. Ow, stop. It actually hurts it. Don't fuck you. Because I'm a boss. Bob the different one on the head. Failure to conform in life won't go unpunished. Also, another fucking game. It's right like <laughs> green light. Right before you reach your goal, nine times out of ten, it will look you in the eye and remort... Remort... <laughs> remort... <laughs> what? <laughs> Tell you to go back to start. In other words, it makes you start over even though... Freaking sucks in Who life. Fuck these dudes, they're so deep. Freeze tag. If someone hits you, stay. Oh! Woo! Telephone. If that was in between a heartbeat, I could have died. <laughs> Accurate reporting is less <laughs> interesting than guessing wildly. See how I sold it? I sold that shit. No, oh, I'm shit. not gonna hit you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna hit you. <laughs> Oh my god. This is why scary. we should be tag team partners. <laughs> oh shit. Should I do another one? No. <laughs> no, no, not a hard one. No. <laughs> Alright. Sorry. I could taste the blood. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> Next, before I go to wrestling. Oh shit, that was it? <laughs> that was the, yeah, that's those all the only games? No, that more. I just got sick of it. Because they're stupid Everything. games anyways. And I'm reeking, so I never played those games. <laughs> those are white people games. So I don't play them. Oh my god. A crocodile was found in New Jersey basement during a drug raid. <laughs> Five drug raids in New Jersey have led to the seizure. Yeah, yeah, you're saying it right. Okay, as I was like, yeah, seizure, I was like, did, yeah. I, did they mean to put that in there? No, you're saying it right. Of normal <laughs> assortment of marijuana, ecstasy, and guns. <laughs> and the removal of... And the removal of not-so-normal thing. Crocodile. Oh, crocodile. A Mercer <laughs> County <laughs> Prosecutor's <laughs> Office. The thing I was trying to say right, I said it wrong. It's prosecutor. <laughs> Officer says, authorities <laughs> found a small crocodile living in the basement of a Trenton house Crocodil. during a raid <laughs> during a raid Thursday and turned it over to animal control. Along with the crocodile, <laughs> 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 authorities found marijuana. Uh, two men were arrested. That was it. Uh, the what? search warrant at the five holes. Wait, what happened to the crocodile? Than- I don't know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, and they turned over to animal control. Oh, okay. The search warrants of the five homes uh, yielded more than 100 grams of ecstasy, two guns, and more than $2,000. A car was also seized. Oh. Authorities say a uh, Bordentown man was the target of the investigation and faces several drug charges. Go, idiot. Next. <laughs> what happened to the crocodile, though? A bullet? Oh, was no, about the crocodile. He went to animal control. control. What happened after animal control? No, call him. A bullet throws a grenade instead of a ball in Ukraine. <laughs> Two people got injured. <laughs> yeah. Only in Ukraine. You throw a grenade. How do you throw a grenade instead of a bowling ball? Wait, how do you confuse a grenade with a bowling ball? Know. How big was that fucking grenade? <laughs> There's no way. Grenades are probably like, what, this big? Yeah. I don't know. I don't yeah, have a bowling ball. Like I don't have a grenade shot. <laughs> I've seen them before. <laughs> you say a bowling ball is this big? Bo- no, I said this big. <laughs> bowling ball this big? This wide? This fat? Like this my sexy. balls. What? 
<laughs> should go see a doctor. Holy shit. I should, I should. Two men have been injured while bowling in a rebel-controlled area of oh, East Ukraine cool. after a player rolled a grenade instead of a ball. Hey, hey, Understandable hey, accident. Hey, hey, admit it. It's okay. Admit it. Wouldn't that be fun? That would be fun. That would be freaking awesome. Um, because ever bowling ball? No, we got grenades. All right then. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Um, a separatist. <laughs> it's like a condom. <laughs> yeah, like a condom. Oh my god! <laughs> a separatist-run news agency cited, cited, so cited. I mean, cited emergency services official Sergei Ivanovsky in saying Friday that the separatist held part of the oh. Hask. A uh, region seen a spate? Spate? <laughs> what? <laughs> the run the sensor gets stupid. What? Um, a spate of accidents. It's not a spade. Spate of accidents. Why are they fucking with me? That's like a continuous. Recently, of because of careless use of explosives, Evashinkum said a man and woman were hospitalized after Thursday's incident. A blast occurred at a Charbonne no, no, no. The people can't understand you, sir. I, I think you should control yourself. <laughs> a restaurant serving fried pastries <laughs> that also offered duck pin bowling. They had duck pin bowling there? <laughs> Which also uses a ball holes, with ball ball without holes. holes, on a relatively short lane. Huh. East Ukraine have been racked by war for almost a year, during which time the region has also been flooded with small arms and grenades. Hey, if you gotta have fun, that's the best way to have fun. Just blow people up. Just bullshit up. I feel like I should call the cops on you. First you threaten to kill me, and I'm talking about blowing people up for fun, John. <laughs> I don't talk about blowing people up. I'm talking about blowing all this you shit You need up. Jesus. Now, off to wrestling. And this is something that I find kind of funny. Um, Tyler Breeze and Bo Dallas have been teaming up in live mm-hmm. events. Yes. What? Tyler Breeze and My Bo God. Dallas teaming up. Guess what their name is? What? Bo Breeze. Bo Breeze! Oh my God! Great. Shut up and take my money right now. Like as you can see, he still has a beard. Oh shit! He still has the beard. Yeah, which it feels weird seeing him like that. Holy though. shit! It feels weird. It's like seeing Bray Wyatt, but in the stupid version. Bo Breeze. Bo Breeze. Holy shit. Bo Breeze. Bo Breeze, man. That's great. So that that's one of the things I found, <laughs> and I think it was in... Mm, gorgeous. It does not say the name. Seattle. In Seattle. Hashtag WWE Seattle. Seattle. It says it, like, right there. Like, in big hashtags, WWE Seattle. Yeah, it says it, like, right there. Okay, yeah, like, I see there. It. I see it. Yeah. Pretty funny to- Freaking phone broke in half accidentally. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, you motherfucker. I want you ready. Now, another thing is something we talked about a lot before was about ROH, um, ROH which a lot of shit's going on. I love Ring of Honor. Yeah. And there's a lot of shit that's going on. And one of them is that they're trying to stop WD from raiding the roster. <laughs> they're taking literally everybody. They're from the taking roster. everybody. And now they're trying to get Joe and. No, they already got Joe. He's going thinking, after thinking spring. Of, He's oh, really? going in. And I heard of uh, they're trying to get Cole and Strong still. They were at the tryouts with yeah. Owens, but they only took Owens. But I heard they were trying to get Cole and. Yeah, Strong. supposedly they locked in the Bucks. Supposedly. No. Supposedly they're they're trying no! to try, they're trying to lock him in. No, I need the Bucks. But the but team. they're still gonna be in, you know, in JPW. I know, but I need them in NXT. You know, and, and, I mean, it, it's up to them. It oh, says right here in the article, it's up to them if they want to be, you know. Oh, I need the bus. But, I mean, I really want them in NXT. I know, I really want them in NXT. I really want them there. So, ROH just decided, you know what? Fuck you, WWE. You're taking all their shit? Fuck you. They're taking all their good And stars. it's going to suck for, you know, indies, too, because they're locking people in, so... It's going to be hard for other indies, like, for example, Young Bucks, right here in Connecticut, they're around here, so it's going to suck for them. Well, no, 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 they can do indies, they just can't leave to WWE. Yeah, that might be the contract. No, it says right here that anywhere else, except for them, except they can do tiny New Japan. Indies. They can do tiny indies, though. Well, I don't know, we'll see about that. We'll see how it goes, because it's, so. still, it's still progressing. I still saw them live, so it's alright. Yeah, it's still progressing, you know issue going on so we don't exactly know I've seen all them live of so it's okay with me screw you another uh, thing is the Bullet Club shirt, remember Jimmy uh, Jacobs yeah 
I love Jimmy. How can I forget Jimmy Jacobs? He I've been a fan of him for years. signed a deal with WWE, and he's suspected to start with the company in April after a WrestleMania 31. Oh, wow. However, he will be working on the creative thing and Fuck. not in wrestling. Um, signing with WWE has been in the works for some time now. His last appearance at ROH was in March 27th in California. That was his last that appearance. That has been wrestling since he was 14, man. I love Jimmy Jacobs. That's how I you, wanted to be like Jimmy Jacobs. That, that's how you know he has good creative um, ideas. I hope they're good. Oh, he does. You know, so we'll, we'll He's see. the reason why Seth Rollins is wrestling. Yeah. Well, not well, that he's wrestling, why he's big. Sorry. It I, is. Yeah. It is. It is. If it wasn't for him, there wouldn't be Age of the Fall. If there wasn't Age of the Fall, true, there wouldn't true, be Seth Rollins. True. Slash Tyler Black. There wouldn't be that amazing promo where he where he had the blood go in his mouth from from um, 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 one of the Briscoes. True. That was a great promo. He went, true. and the blood came in his mouth. Because oh, they hung shit. the Briscoes from the ceiling. Yeah. When he was bleeding. Pool of blood. I think the camera should stop for no reason right now. I just realized that the number's on zero. I'm not kidding. Oh, my God. And I was recording, and it said recording. Oh, my God. That's from full memory, that's why. Oh, my God. We still have the audio. It's okay. We got the audio. We're oh, good. I sat on the kitchen. I sat on the thing. So, we're good. You know what? I'm turning off the, the freaking camera. I'm going to delete all that crap because it's freaking stupid. Oh, shit. Thanks a lot, fucking Canon. Um, assholes. But we're still like, man, we're going to be the sponsors, but fuck them, you know? <laughs> fuck this motherfucker. They don't even know it's Canon, so now they know. So, fuck you. I'm buying a different one. <laughs> Keeping it OG now. Yeah, old school. It back to old Back school. to the computer. What were we talking about? Oh, yeah. Drinking blood. Dude, it, it disappeared. You better check. Okay. Thank God. <laughs> I was scared. I was like, no. I would have no. cried. I would have cried. <clears throat> but now, something that actually me and Nate were talking about this last night, texting, whatever, watching Raw. It was like, oh, how cool it would be just saying Brock United titles. Unified titles, UFC title, and yeah, that would fucking happen. That would be cool, but it's, it's, not, happening. it's not fucking happening. It's not happening. No, that, that, nah. like you know, and, and still, it's just having Brock and UFC and in WWE. That's not happening because you have Vince uptight as shit. <laughs> yeah, he's not gonna allow that to happen. And then Dana is not gonna allow that to happen either mm. because it brings like a part of like you know, kind of a fake perspective in UFC just like Bellator yeah. is with TNA because they have you know they're both together and shit like that with, with Lashley with Lashley so it's a horrible idea um another thing is they're talking about oh yeah Brock should, is probably you know after Mania he could probably just take the title he, and he talked about it in the promo which you probably watched it what this morning mm-hmm. you know you saw his promo his promo was pretty good keep cutting his fucking mic yeah, well keep, Paul Heyman's mic yeah Paul Heyman but no, I like his promo not with Paul, but no, yeah, the other one was like the black room. Yeah, was which th- I like that one better. In my debut, in my I beat debut, I beat no. Nah, he says something. Yeah, I beat the Rock. I sent him Mania. to Hollywood. Yeah, I sent him to Hollywood. Sent his ass to Hollywood, and then WrestleMania 30, I broke the streak. But I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I'm an ass kicker. <laughs> not lie. I like Brock as a wrestler because he brings that like he brings a good amount of entertainment and everything yeah. he does, which I I'm surprised he does. <laughs> Because he's... How old is he? He's about... Probably around... In his 40s. Yeah, he's, I think he's around low 40s. Yeah, low 40s. Fucking Brock. And his wife's in like her late 100s. 60. <laughs> 50 around there. Around 50 something. Oh, shit. I mean, if he likes MILF, he likes MILF. I mean, that's, you know, that's, that's him, but... <laughs> Go ahead, Brock. I, I don't know I don't know why, but... <laughs> oh, shit. I, I, that, if he likes it, I'm fine yeah, with you it. You like the wrinkles, Brock. You go, all right. I guess... Hey, that has to be something else there. I don't know what it is. Brock, go suck those wrinkles off her face. I think it was the great blowjobs he got. Maybe he fell in love. But anyways, <laughs> another thing was Roman Reigns. Steve. There's still people saying doubt on him and shit. Yeah. You saw his shirt? It, yeah, I liked it. I, I like it. I want that shirt. Yeah, me too. It's cool. It, 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 <clears throat> it explains a I lot. I can, I will, and I believe that. that. <laughs> <laughs> You hear everybody, what the fuck's my phone? <laughs> I, love, I love the crowd going, Daniel Bryan's like, even they doubt me. And the crowd was like, oh shit. It's like, oh, he called oh, us out. Oh, oh shit, he, he was... He, they started cheering him after that. Yeah, I know, it was like, you fucking hypocrites. <laughs> now, what else was it? The, oh, the Intercontinental Championship match at Mania. I'm kind of... Eh, about that. I'm happy for it. I'm, I'm excited. Yeah, but I feel it's hurting... The, the, the stupid shit that's going around... I feel that's hurting the championship. Oh, I love that. I it find feels it so goofy. 
Nobody's he no no title has changed recently, so it's not really affecting the title True. runs. They're just tossing it around. They're just stealing it from him. It feels weird seeing that though. Funny. I I, I it's, so lie, it's funny. Me. I love it. I love it. But having Dean Ambrose do it at first it was great. Yeah. But having all these people doing it at the same time I was like, yo, can you guys like No, I love it. it. I love it. It kept it fresh. I, I feel, Dean Ambrose, like I love Dean Ambrose, but if he kept doing it, people yeah. would be like, Alright, he's gonna take it again. But I, I feel having people like yeah. take it for him and like give it to him and shit. It's funny. I feel that Vince was behind that though, because he has that goofy feel. Yeah, it's and funny, Vince though. is kind of that kind of person that likes goofy yeah. feel and shit. So it's good though. I like it, it. It's entertaining. It's okay. Me. Yeah, I would say it's okay. But I, 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 my opinion, I feel is somewhat hurting it. But the, you know, the match is probably gonna bring more prestige to it because it's gonna look, you know, that match is gonna be so good. Exactly. It's like the six man tag stole the show exactly. on Monday. Like, yeah. Holy shit. So we'll, we'll, you know, it was freaking hilarious. I love that. I mean, I thought Ziggler. Kept losing all the time. I was like, yo, are you okay? Like, you good? Like, just got messed up. Are you still kicking out? Those super kicks, though? Like, are you trying to pull a Cena? Like, Those super kicks, though? Yeah. From Ziggler? Yeah. Ooh, yeah. I felt that shit. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Or if it was the Divas match that's going on lately, I don't know what the It should have been Nikki versus Brief. It should have. But, you know. It should have. Unless, unless this could happen. They go to Mania. Then Nick then Breach just decides to turn on right there in Mania. You know how crazy that would be. It should be, but she should have did that at before um, Fast Lane or the night after. Yeah. Turn on her and then build up to them fighting for the title. It would have been so much more better. So much better. Yeah. But I, I don't know what they're gonna do. Same thing. Like they're not. I I feel they're not using the divas right. At least them four. <laughs> yeah. You know Paige, AJ. You know I feel they're not using them properly, which sucks. Now you look at NXT, they know how to use them. I think AJ's just waiting on her contract. When that contract comes and she's not resigning. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so either. I really don't. I mean, she's got, done everything. She's nothing else for her. Exactly. Did Damn, she's got, what, the championship for, what, four times? Mm-hmm. And she's the longest reigning. Longest reigning? She, yeah, she's done. I mean, what so, else are you going to do? Nothing. Yeah, there's, <laughs> there's nothing for her to do. do. Unless you do a Divas tag team, which I doubt it. No. That's not happening, you know, but. I mean, that only worked in TNA when TNA was good. Yeah, back in well, like two thousand five, six. Mm-hmm. Yeah, back when it, they it, dropped when the it belts good. in like two thousand like eleven, when Eric Young was one of the tech titles. <laughs> when <laughs> MEB, <laughs> so it was funny. Eric Young, man, I like and that Eric Young. They, no one's okay, but yeah, that's not talk about TNA. Cause TNA still they fucked up so bad again. <laughs> now Drew McIntyre is in a fucking tag team now for no reason. Yeah, they fucked up the first that week, I hear. I haven't seen it in yeah, weeks. The first month, it's like, oh, shit, that's really good. Then after that, it's like, oh, fuck. <laughs> they fucked it up again. The last episode so, I saw was when he fought... Who did he fight? Last time I, no, the last one I saw was, like, Eric Young versus Bobby Roode. That's the last one I, I watched. I saw when Jim McIntyre fought Kenny King, like, two, three weeks ago. Yeah, that, like, that's I, haven't, I haven't watched that in a while. And that was the first so. episode I watched since they went off Spike. I mean, they... What the hell is that? Okay, never mind. I really want ROH and Spike. I really do. Yeah, Have you too. seen the Spike logo, though? It feels... Yeah, the new one. It looks sick. It looks slick. Yeah, the new one. You know, because most of their channels are like, you know, Bar Rescue, um, yeah. Coaching Bad, um, Framework, Ink Master. I love that show. Yeah. You know, and shows like that, so having that makes it makes it look okay. Having our age there makes it better. <laughs> it'll Man, a thousand times R-H better. so badly. I just watch our wish on HD night every Monday yeah. before Raw. Before Raw went three hours. Eight the, o'clock the, from 8 to 9 was Ring of Honor. I remember watching Adam Cole's debut with Kyle O'Reilly and it was fucking amazing. And I loved Adam Cole ever since then. Yeah, another thing is um, ROH going to Spike. That could be the only company in my... Well, yeah, the only company, in my opinion, that can, in the U.S. that can go up against WWE. The only one. And I think they're making a plan to go up for it because locking in... The freaking super well, the roster. The roster. I wouldn't call them super so they're not there, but the roster makes you kind of spect like you know think a little bit. Yeah, you know that's one of them because back then I was didn't care. Now they're actually caring, so that has to be a sign that they had. You know, they got a toy deal. They got oh, they have replica yeah. belts. Have you seen the yeah, replica I've titles? Seen them. I've seen them. I fucking need one. You the know, price so, of the new one. I was like, bruh. So you know, I get it tax makes you money. think. I get my tax money in yeah. too. I was like. Oh. I need the classic one. I need the classic. What's, what's your title. social security number, please? Um, one one. Fuck you. I don't think that's a number, sir. I will shoot you in the nose. Why in the nose? Why can't it be in the head? See, look like Michael Jackson. 
Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's right. Embarrassment's better than death. True. No, I got... <laughs> I got dark so quick. <laughs> no, with UFC... I don't know how the hell Rafael Dos Anjos won. Yeah, this, no That was here. so surprising. He got... I mean, you had freaking oh, Anthony Pettis. What's your name? That weird girl with that last name, the Liz Chick Booka, whatever. Dude, she, that Russian chick or she whatever messed she's from. her up. Bad. She knocked her out. <laughs> Where's she from? I think she's Russian, right? Yeah, she's Russian. She looks yeah, fucking she weird. She messed her up. She she's weird. a straw, woman's strawweight champion. Congrats to her. Strawweight. I mean, they're, they're super skinny. Get you light skinny. as hell. They're, they're, she they was are. like super skinny. Super skinny. me. Crazy. You know, and then... What other thing was it? Um, you heard about Leila Ali? Yeah, I heard. Calling out Ronda Rousey? I heard. I heard. Oh my gosh, she said the stupidest thing. She's like, I could beat her. She's the size of my daughter or whatever. Ronda Rousey's like, size doesn't fucking matter. Have you seen? She, she goes, all the people I've fought have been bigger than me, and I've beat them in less than 30 seconds. Like, like <laughs> it means fucking nothing. Like, bitch. Don't you understand? She's All you know is how to punch. She's, like, <laughs> she's won the Olympics. How to break her fucking arm. She's a fucking <laughs> Olympian. Yeah, exactly. In judo. That's exactly. one of them. She knows jiu-jitsu. She recently <laughs> is trying to get better on her striking, which if she gets better, there's no freaking way you can put her down. You she know. told Layla, she was like, if she wants to find me, then I'm here waiting exactly. for her. Exactly. So, <laughs> I, like, I want Oh, Layla, don't do it. Don't yeah, she's do stupid it. if she does that. <laughs> like, if you if you want... It, nah, still. If she still punks out of it, it's, she still looks like a bitch. Yeah. No matter how she does it. she looks like a woman. See, she should have, yeah. She should have just, like, stayed quiet and just leave, let her happen. Shut the fuck up. Who is walking above us? I don't know, people. There's another apartment upstairs. I'm scared. Now, on the side note, well, not on the side note. This is like, is it, it's been so long I haven't talked about technology. It's been, what, well, since the second episode? I haven't talked about it. Mm-hmm. So, another thing is Nintendo will make games for phones and a new system. Yes, Nintendo on phones. I mean, the games. I want another new system. I, I've been. It, supposedly, the um, project name is called NX. Right there, it sounds cool. Um, supposedly, they're thinking of bringing like certain like games. Of course, like Mario, Zelda, and stuff like that. I hope it's not like the Wii, though. I don't want a game like the Wii. Anymore. No, I, I mean, I don't. Th- I don't think it would. I don't want that anymore. Because I feel that they know. Is that that stuff is more for kids, so they gotta attract both audiences. Like for example, the Xbox does it with a Kinect. They have PlayStation does it. With PlayStation the, does it. They have a little big planet. They have. Yeah, with PlayStation Eye. Yeah, PlayStation Eye. That control things. Like, control yeah, control you control know, and it, in my opinion, it sucks, but yeah. it, it's it's good enough. We had the connect. We have the connect at my house. My brother's Xbox. Yeah. No, it's PlayStation Four, so he doesn't care. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't care anymore. Yeah, who cares anymore? Yeah. I have a Wii, but it's put away. I still I come in Nintendo sixty four more than my Wii. You have <laughs> yeah yeah same same. And I put PS because I have a lot. good game. You can play GameCube games on it, so mm-hmm. of course, you know. But it was confirmed today. Um, they're arriving. You know, like popular gaming characters will be arriving on smart devices. Courtesy of a new tie-up, um, this com this because they said, oh, let's go with this company, so we can try to put it in phones. Now, what the hell is the name of this company? I'm trying D E N A. D N A. D N A. Dina. Dina. Or so, I don't know. Dena. Dena. You want some Dena? Dena. Nega. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh no. Oh no. Let's ignore that. Which pu- you know, this company publishes <laughs> What just happened? This turned sound so quick. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> well think of it was the podcast. Uh- <laughs> oh no. No. Oh my god. No. I was talking about video games and you just made this racial. Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. It's never happened. Thank God this isn't on video. Oh my God! People don't listen. Oh. People don't listen to the end of it anyway. Oh my God! <laughs> no, some of them do. Trust me, I know a couple. I know a good amount of. I people. know. I know a few too. Yeah. Oh shit. But this company DNA or Dina or whatever we want to call it publishes. <laughs> Say the other word so I don't feel bad. <laughs> publishes a range of free to play. Say it. No. Pol- I don't feel bad. No. Publishes a free. <laughs> to play mobile games, Nintendo content will be coming to game apps for smart devices. It'll be free. No, I think you have to still pay for it. Bullshit. 
If um, it's on the phone, it should be fucking free. I pay for I pay my bills for the phone. But, true, true. But supposedly for the console, for a new system, there's nothing. You know, the only thing we know is just the name, like the project name. That's it. That's all we know about no, it. Prototype images of how it looks or anything. No, no, no. Just the name. Just the project name. And X. I want pictures. I want to see how this shit looks. See, because back then, remember back in the GameCube, um, back when we had N64, they mentioned Dolphin a lot of certain stuff, and the code name for the GameCube was Dolphin, which was weird. Don't know why. Supposedly we were going to name it Dolphin, but they changed the GameCube, which makes sense. GameCube's much better. <laughs> it makes complete sense. Much better than Dolphin. Oh, it's just an entailed Dolphin. Like, <laughs> really? <laughs> Worst name. NX sounds so sick. Same thing though. with Wii U. I NX feel. sounds so sick, NX. though. Now, this is the project name. Most of the time where they have Project names like that, just project names. Somehow they make it sound better. Except on the Wii U, the Wii U they messed up bad. Cause Wii U yeah. like is like what Wii U like. I hate the Wii U. I don't know why, but never, yeah. even, never even debated about getting that shit. Uh, never. Uh, now, of course, everybody has watched Guardians of the Galaxy. Mm-hmm. Of course, and a lot of people were thinking about why does Drax looks at Baby Groot in the end dancing? He just looks at him with the death stare. Do you know why? Why? I we, bet you're going to tell me in like two seconds. No, but I want to know why. What do you think it is? I don't know. Well, for starters, I don't know if you guys realize around the metal, around when they meet Drax, he hates dancing. And he said that if he had his own like plan or anything to conquer, he will ban dancing. And if that happens, he will kill whoever dances. Oh, I So that's that. why Baby Groot, when he was dancing and stuff, and Drax looked at him, he stopped. That's why he looked back. He kept going. That's the reason why. It clicks. Exactly. And, you know, the, um, you know, James Gunn um, said that in an interview. That was one of the deleted scenes. Really? That happened within the movie. They just deleted that part where, you know, he was, well, where Drax was talking about that kinds of stuff. So, it, it was weird reading this. <laughs> it was like, now it makes sense yeah. why that happened. But it's still, thank God they deleted that part because it makes it look funnier. Yeah. Doesn't make it look dreadful. <laughs> yeah, I know. Make it, it doesn't make it scary. Like, you feel so, bad. So, I still want a baby group. I really want we a have baby one. group. Not even fucking kidding. You press the song, you press the button, the song plays and he dances. Or you can take your iPhone. I need it. Put music next to him and he'll dance to your music. Or, I need Not even buy, lying. Or, 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 or Walmart. I need to go. $10. Oh, dude, I need it. I need that. You put your song, your phone next to me. It's motion, sen- it's um, sound censored. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. Now, another thing, final thing that I'm going to talk about is the DC Comics pulls controversial Bad Girl cover. Mm. Now, I found this out today thanks to Gabe's brother. Um, You're should I say the name, his name if yeah. he wants to? You know, Drew Foster. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, it was all over Twitter about this. It, once I got home, I was looking on Twitter. I see him talking about it, I was like, huh, I'm kind of curious what it is. So I check it out, and the picture is, it, it's something. Well, for me, it's fine because of the background story about it, you know, from what I've heard and read today. I was just reading before. I don't even see why that's controversial. The reason why, supposedly, you, you can read it, you can go ahead and read it for me. While certainly an effective image as far as portraying Joker as the scariest and most intimidating, the cover drew ire for many fans because of what is seen as a sexual undertone to Joker's treatment of Batgirl. See, but he, here's the thing: it depends. It, it all takes. It all talks about perspective. And in my opinion, you know, he's not even doing anything sexual. He has his hand over exactly. her shoulder with a gun pointed down. That's it. Um, and drawing a smile of blood on her mouth. That's it. And she's like crying. And it makes sense for the background story that's going on. Another thing is, in my opinion, for, you know, it got pulled out. The cover got pulled out by the, well, actually the, not the writer, god damn, the freaking, uh, how do you call it? Whoever made that, basically, I I don't know the name, it's there. What's his name? I forgot his name. That's how sad it is right now. (laughs) Keep going, keep going. Right, keep going, it's around there somewhere. Nope, just as the writer's names. Albuquerque. That's that's the name. But yeah. It was that, paying homage to the Killing Joke. It was a series where he killed yeah, her. Yeah, back in... Um, People said supposedly he sexually assaulted her because he took naked pictures of her and sent them to Gordon. 
Supposedly, that I don't believe that. Yeah, same. But they never said it. They never said he did it. Never said he did. You know, do the it. the writers never confirmed it. So technically, hashtag free Joker. <laughs> my boy didn't do it. Exactly. Didn't I got do your it. back. Didn't do it. But in my opinion, it was kind of stupid of him to take it off. One mm-hmm. reason why controversial. Controversy leads to people to go towards they said people were stuff. Basically, they just said people were getting mad because in the comic book now, it's like super happy and go lucky and stuff. Yeah, and then it's just that one's just like That's dark. like a dark cover, yeah. So it kind of brings it down. That's the cover to Killing Joke. I know, but uh, in, my, in my opinion, it's just stupid in his part because controversy leads to curiosity. Yeah. Okay? And that's... It's basically, people just being stupid. Exactly. Like, for example, let's go back to wrestling with Punk. Yeah. It led to curiosity about the pipe bomb back then. So far, there hasn't been any... Uh, new cover yeah. made so this might be it hmm. I'm okay with it I'm fine with it too there's nothing fucking wrong with it people just need to chill out it's 2015 you know, but it, it's probably people get ripped all the time you know so <laughs> it, it, it all depends people's perspective but it's just people that haven't read yeah. that one that's probably why yeah you know cause I feel like another it thing was sick. yeah another thing was I've seen forums and stuff like that talking about it and you've seen people oh it's fine it's well it's just people like only read these comics but never read the you know the other ones, which is playing you know homage to that kind of yeah. stuff. You know I haven't read it. Be, I'll now be honest. What the new Fifty Two is doing, they're taking people, uh, characters, and putting them on covers with other ones. Like Harley Quinn had a whole variant cover. Everybody in New Fifty Two yeah. had a variant cover with Harley Quinn. Like they had like Green Lantern racing her exactly, yeah. and rollerblading and stuff, and they had all this cool stuff. And Joker had his, and they said he was doing it like in humorous ways, like just doing Joker shit. And then yeah. that's why people are making a big deal because this one's like really dark and scary. But, but then again, this is a Joker. Yeah. yeah, this is a Joker. He's, He's a, a Joker. villain. You, you yeah. can imagine a compl- uh, villain being completely like, sorry. He kills people. Exactly. So it has to, you know, you know, chaos and I hate people so peacefulness much. have to coexist. Because if not, people. it's gonna be a wreck. Yeah. But that, that's all I got people right being now. Being dumbasses. Yeah. But uh, we're probably doing we're probably doing a top ten later on. Um, cause I actually found a top 10 that I didn't say it here in the show because it says 10. So I want to make this a top 10. Um, as probably right now, it's not going to be released. Oh yeah. Today. Happy St. Patty's Day. It's St. Patty's Day. Um, so later on, I mean, I hope in this week, uh, I don't think so, but probably next week we we'll probably might have a top 10 with St. Patty's Day, mm-hmm. even though it's super late. Who cares? But... Just for people that around this area that live around us, they know us. We're probably doing around the time. We're busy. Around. We have lives. Hartford, Patty's Day, Sam Patty's Day, because they postpone it. Don't because of rain stuff like that. We have lives. They swear. So we're probably doing it at that time. Mm-hmm. I kind of want to go to that Sam Patty's Day, but I don't want to get shot in Hartford. And it is officially announced. We have another podcast. Yeah. Uh, not just it's not our podcast. It's uh we're part of FWL Live Radio, coming uh after WrestleMania season three. When season three starts, uh FWL Live Start. Radio is up yeah. with uh yours truly Gabriel Donovan's and Rogue. Uh, Jonathan is Rogue. I'm Gabriel Donovan's yeah. of course, and uh we're gonna be accompanied by other FWL superstars talking about wrestling. Um, Good old wrestling. All about wrestling. About the pay per view. Yeah, uh, every that, single that yeah. Yeah. So um. Thank you, everybody, for listening to World of Censor Podcast episode whatever. Don't even know what episode this is. We yeah. have so many episodes. Um, I lost count. Yeah, me too. We'll um, probably do it when we save it. Probably shows up. We hope you guys have a fantabulous day. Have a splendiferous, Difference. have a splendiferous morning, night, afternoon, whatever, lunch, whenever dinner, you're watching, whenever this. you're listening to this. Happy whatever. So even if you're in the shower listening to us, thank you. That'll be weird. Um, but anyways, no. Thank you. <laughs> thank, thank you. you.